standard procedure. She bad with the features. She bad, that's a misdemeanor. Sick with it, I might catch a fever. You know I like it when you wear my. Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Block Center, the home of Nigerian African Boxing. And please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click like, of course, the sub, subscribe button right now. Let's just go straight to it with hesitation. We all know that Francis Agano and Tyson Fury fight um, is set to take place very soon. October 28th, it is a big night for uh missed martial arts i would say i would say boxing because boxing i mean a lot of like a lot of boxing fans i'm looking forward to the fight as um an enthusiast both but the thing is that both guys okay god i wouldn't really put too much blame on him but fury there are options like the only speed option is there who well, is but he doesn't they want to take it because this guy really just don't want to fight them. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. They don't just want to fight Usyk for one reason or another. I don't know. It'll be weird. Now, even though I believe he can beat Usyk, you know, he has more chance of beating Usyk. But I think because Usyk is a skillful guy as him, and he's gonna be a tricky fight. Usyk's um, weakness is already there. I mean, is for the to the body. But let's get straight to the right here, guys. Um, yes, Francis Gano has now accused um, Tassi Fury of shooting. Uh, with his gloves in past fights he said he's very tricky with gloves with his gloves i think he's cheating when he fought deontay Wilder, he complained about that i've heard a lot of complaints about his gloves that his gloves have no protection it might not be but we have to check that um he said this on joe rogan uh, podcast what do you guys make of this accusation uh, Ty, Jack, where you take on this right here? Yo, uh, I'm gonna put this into into uh, per perspective, or I'm gonna break this down. Tyson, Fury, okay, Tyson Fury has been con has been I've been told, you know, there's been accusations against him in the past. Fury has been called that he's been cheating peds you know pds or drugs all this thing and pe if people do if, at this point in his stage of the career i do believe tyson fury has been getting away with cheating you know he de he, he denied being he denied using the, the, don't forget the board game you know that's why they took away his uh his uh uk license he doesn't want to. He doesn't. He doesn't want to fight in the UK because if he if he if he decides to get his license back, one he will have to serve that ban, and that case will be would have to be reopened. Right? He decided not to. Um, there was a young. There was a young fighter. Um, you know, not. I wouldn't say much of a young fighter. The guy, you know, he 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 uh, spars with um, heavyweights. There was an accusation of Fury um cheating with uh there was there was no padding in the gloves and you know he picked up those gloves we saw those gloves and we saw that he didn't have a uh, padding in there it was it was it was weird you know and we've heard in numerous camps that tyson fury has done it you know i'm based off tyson fury's past alone the guy i know for a fact the guy cheats just based off his past alone you cannot continue fooling i don't care his his fans are his fans but the guy the guy's a well-known cheater even i i remember i uh i i uh commented on so and i asked the, this guy paulie benanaji he was i asked him a question he was like yeah tyson fury cheats it was regarding he was like you don't go around you if you if you weren't born with knocking people out you're not all of you're not going to be all of a sudden trying to knock people out in this stage in your career it doesn't even matter who your coach is right and it just comes to it just comes to mind that 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 makes sense especially at the at a high caliber level right you never you you never had punching power at a low caliber level 
but all of a sudden now you started having punching power at a high caliber level all of a sudden like you're, you're known for this big you're known to be a puncher now you know not 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 even say mind you you know uh uh it's just a lack of it's just a lack of uh of how how uh how wild are fights and you know and you being able to lack significant punches anyways even while they said it himself in the first fight you're pillow fisted you know all of a sudden it, it changed up to where he was no longer pillow fisted he he was not he, he knocked wilder out that didn't make sense to me in the first in the, in the second fight right he literally knocked wilder out so i think in that fight he actually cheated no matter what no matter how you look at it those gloves did not look right no matter how you looked at it okay but now when it came to when it came to you know all these rumors and uh, all the situation that's been going on with Tyson Fury you know it does not hurt to actually look into this to make sure this guy to make sure this guy is not cheating to put in to put in place certain things to make sure even has he even he, he has to be watched 20 even he if even though he has to be watched 24/7 by anybody on the opposing team you know the commissioner they got to watch him like 24/7 they got to watch all they got to watch every everyone on this team to make sure they're not cheating cuz let's be honest man those guys and Fury's team and camp they are cheaters no matter even if Sugar to still say oh, he doesn't know maybe 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 he doesn't he's not aware of it but any 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 one of them in his corner are cheating i don't care what nobody says if you weren't knocking people out now at a low caliber level you're not going to be knocking them out at a high caliber level you know maybe that's why he's trying to avoid <coughs> maybe that's why he's trying to avoid Usyk you know there could be a lot of there could be a lot of things going on you know that's why maybe he's avoiding Usyk maybe he's avoiding AJ but all of a sudden like I'm looking at the Derek Chisor fight he was he looked like he didn't lump up Derek Chisor Derek Chisor complained about Tyson Fury's gloves also you know all of a sudden like Tyson Fury now he he caught he made Derek Chisor look funny you know like I said man it's it's going to be eventually they, they're going to have to look into these accusations cuz you know you cry you cry um you cry wolf long enough you know and people don't believe you eventually <laughs> it's going to be a big bad wolf right there you know that's actually right there and the accusation is going to be true i believe i i like i've said so i believe tyson fury has been cheating and he's been getting away no i'm i'm not i'm not a tyson fury hater i'm just calling facts you're not gonna you're not gonna bully one heavyweight and call him a cheater and not see and and, and when there's when there's there when there's one in front of you who's been cheating his who's been cheating his whole life continuously cheating we've known he's, he's been a cheater the board gate pd use you know the glove gate all, all these things put together but you guys want to cram you guys want to you guys want to call one heavyweight that he's a cheater but but uh let, let's see where Francis Ngannou goes with this i really hope they put the team puts together um puts together a a a a good a good game plan and how to make sure Tyson Fury's not cheating listen the whole boxing world knows it these old guys that've been in boxing long enough know it there's one way you could cheat in boxing especially with your with your gloves where you can manipulate them they've been saying it for the longest you know even Mike Tyson might be aware of it but it's he probably can't say nothing you know it's only a matter of time till you get caught i'm i'm only going to i'm only going to say it i'm only going to say it if Tyson Fury does not knock out his opponents as is the way he's supposed to he's going to get caught they're going to have to stop believing that he's actually a cheater and he's I, I like i said man i don't i just don't believe this guy man i don't the guy's been getting away with a lot of shit you know and Mauricio Suleiman is 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 the guy who's been letting him get away with it but let's see let's see where it goes i i wish I wish I'm more interested in this fight but I'm just not that interested in this fight because it's really not boxing. It's simple as that. Thanks but I appreciate your take on this. Tyson Fury is not an innocent, innocent guy. He's been busted. You know he served uh, ten, I think he was he was busted before for drug for PD after the Klitschko fight, right? He had he and uh the uh, Fury they had uh, they found a uh 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 some substance in their system. Um Mario Joe, what do you make of this uh, accusation um coming from Francis Ngannou who is not even a boxer but you know kind of wary in a way that say you know in, in terms of 
<laughs> a lot of people can be saying, listen, people, people can, different people can be accusing you of the same thing. I think there has to be some truth in it, right? Um, see, obviously you, you guys know that I'm not, I'm not a fan of Tyson Fury. Um, but at the same time, I'm not going to be sentimental. Um, see, as far as I'm concerned, if you have not been caught doing something, no, not caught, if you have not been con convicted of an offense, I think it would be unfair for anyone to, I mean, yes, he's been accused, okay, in several locations, all right? But you cannot bring accusation as, accusation is not the same as conviction. Um, so even if he has been cheating, which I believe he has been, but he's not been convicted for it. Now, I won't blame Tyson Fury. And why did I say that I won't blame him? The onus, the responsibility is on the, the opposing team, the, the, the coach, the managers, whatever, for them to make sure yeah, especially when there are rumors around Tyson Fury being a, a glove cheat. We know he's, he's been convicted for, you know, for using uh, uh, substances to, to, to aid his performance. So that, when it comes to that, I can say, yes, he's a drug cheat because he has been convicted of it in the past, right? So I can, I can turn around and say that, yes, I believe that you, Mr. Fury, you are a drug cheat. Why? Because you have been convicted in the past. So there is a very great possibility that you might still be on drugs. There is a very good possibility that you might still be cheating when it comes to PEDs. But with this old glove thing, yeah, yes, Chizora accused him. His former um, sparring partner, the young guy from America, accused him. Several people have accused him, but has he been convicted? No. So if you know that this guy He's got history of these accusations. Just make sure that your team, that's why with the OD on the wider accusation and all of that, I just I just didn't buy it because come on, man, you the on the wider, you are at the time anyway, a world champion. And you should have experienced people, experienced people around you, people who know exactly what they're doing. So if you're doing glove inspection and all of that, and you still allow the guy to cheat, then you are the fool then. In all honesty, she's also accused as inferior of being a glove cheat. Fair enough. But the shame is on you, Shizora, that your team weren't good enough to catch him. All right? And what do we know about Tyson Fury? He's a trick star. All right? He's a trick star. And we all know this about him. You already know his character. So when you're dealing with him, you make sure you leave no stone unturned. So for me, I'm not really going to pay much attention to that. Yes, he's a drug cheat. Yes, there has been accusations of, you know, tampering with his gloves and all of that. But do I blame him for that? No, I don't. I blame the team that can't do their job properly. So um, Ungano, now that you know all of this, it's not like Ngano has a chance anyway, I have to be honest, because this is not boxing. This is just some... He has a chance. Some... He, has a, he has a Pontus chance, bro. Yeah, well, bro, how much of a chance of just a conscious chance? Like, have you seen Ngannou's, um training clips, bro? The guy is not a boxer, man. He's I not know. A boxer at I all. know he's, be, he's been he's been uh, tutored by Mike Mike Tyson. However, yeah, he does have a yeah. chance. Yeah, he's not he's not a boxer, man. I've seen his clips and it's just a joke to me. I'm sorry. Um, anyway, um, yeah. So I just hope that Ngano and his team they do the right thing. They check this guy properly. They check his gloves. Proper texts, um, they, they make sure that they get VADA involved and make sure that they, 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 they carry out proper proper tests on him and just to make sure that he's not. I'll be more concerned about Tyson Fury using some PEDs than the old glove thing, to be honest, because that's the one he has been he has been convicted of. So that's that's what I'm gonna say. Um if you allow him to get away with it, that's your problem, mate, in all honesty. But you should do your job and make sure that this guy don't tamper with his gloves and if he does it and he gets away with it then the, the fault is, is on you man you know so that's all i got to say bro thanks bro i appreciate your take on this guys you've heard it from our brothers my old joe and ty ajagwe we'll definitely be right back you know we we'll, uh, we'll join you guys we'll, be, we'll go live today for the joe joyce janjali rematch 
and um like i said before if, if any of you guys have no means of watching the fight hit me up on instagram follow me there and i'll definitely bless you with something guys um my instagram is raymond f l or lord r dot e dot o um lord real so guys stay blessed god bless you all cheers she bad with the feature